what's up everybody welcome back to the channel guys now before we do start this if you want an update on what's been going on in the community with just the leaks and everything that's been going on i'm gonna have a video about all of that dropping tomorrow but for today we're gonna specifically be looking at what is going on with the whole alley and grade a situation or everything that she's claiming what we saw in the leaked video everything so we're just gonna dive on into this but i want everyone to keep in mind that the key word for this video is honestly gonna be allegedly because not one is these things has been proven yet nothing's went to court we don't really have any kind of proof for anything at the moment other than just Ali's word and then just kind of what we have from Pete which we'll get into after we get through what Ali really said so just keeping all of that in mind all of this is alleged we don't know for sure yet and we'll talk a little bit more about that at the end of the video but we're gonna just start with showing you this two-minute clip of everything that Ali's claimed yeah it was two days straight um, anyway, Carol's here. You go over to her. what's going on. Cool. And I've been quiet for the past year and a half. Plus, and to myself, took myself away from everyone because I knew what was going to happen. If people knew what happened the day before Jared passed and, and the day that Jared passed and everything that which I cannot speak upon at this moment but I will I will I just have to make sure that I am safe so please one don't show anyone this but two know that you guys have my full support because I'm, I cannot let Jared's legacy be what it is Jared would never treat any of his fans like this one and two would never ever let it's over it's always been about money. And Jared made enough money to not have this issue. I would literally sit on his lap every day and be like, don't go record. They don't need they don't need us. They don't need you anymore. You made so many songs that were a liability being here. They didn't think I was gonna make it through this year. There's been plenty of times literally tried they've tried and tried their hardest to make sure I wasn't going to be here and I pushed and kept going because of this reason only and I will make sure that shit changes I just have to make sure that I am safe first so again please don't show I'm going to break well, first, I'm going to take it to court. So as you can see, the video is a little all over the place and you're just getting a little bit of mixed thoughts throughout it. And we also don't know for sure, at least at the time I'm making this video, who Ali sent this video to. But besides all of that, Ali makes some pretty serious claims in this that for one, she goes on and talks about how what's going on with Juice's legacy and everything is not what Juice would have done. But that's not anywhere close to the deepest stuff that she gets into. She literally states in the video that she was going silent and basically just waiting to reveal this or reveal what she's doing in court because she's trying to stay safe and she goes on to say in one of the captions that she's moved so many times so she couldn't be found. She also says that she didn't ask for any money and she wanted nothing to do but to make Juice's legacy what he wanted. She even goes on to make the claim that they, which I'm assuming she's referring to grade A or the label or at least some people in that group that they tried to make sure she wasn't here now that's what she says definitely remember that all of this is allegedly nothing has been confirmed yet we're just going over what's happened so far now the next caption Ali put is if I'm gone they have no one in their way to make up any story that they want I have not spoken to his mom or management for over a year because I've seen from before juice passed what was going to happen now Ali claims that she's taking this to court and that she has proof of stuff or everything now that's what she claims allegedly that is what Ali is claiming happened and this is according to her the series of events now Pete did respond to this video on a now deleted Instagram comment where he said I hope this is a deep fake because WTF at the time I'm making this video that's all we've seen anybody from grade A actually say about this situation now something I do want to look at is there's been some instances in the past where some stuff 
Ali said hasn't always lined up. And I think that that's something that you should take into account just for the fact that I don't think anybody should really jump to a conclusion on who's in the right or who's in the wrong here. I don't personally have a side right now just because we don't know the specifics yet. We don't have proof of anything yet. All we have is the information laid in front of us. So you can definitely make an opinion on it or think what you want to think on it. But I'm not here to persuade your thoughts in any way. I'm literally just here to report what's happened and let you guys know kind of what's going on. According to Ali, this is going to be going to court and it could definitely become a way more serious issue. Now, will that happen? Only time's going to tell. But keeping this all in mind, if what Ali is saying is true, then that means the entire narrative of the Juice documentary that we saw was all just made up or not even true. It was just a fake, basically put together storyline that left out what really happened allegedly. So we're really just going to have to wait and see what happens with this entire situation, if anything's going to happen because this video did leak or whatever ends up happening. But the last thing I wanted to go over was just a tweet from Travis where he goes on to state that allegedly Juice's label made Ali sign a non-disclosure agreement about Juice's death while she was under the influence of drugs. Then they cut her off, tried their hardest to make sure she wasn't going to be here and she's going to take it to court. So that's like a recap of everything Ali is claiming. Allegedly, again, just remember that, that nothing is proven yet. We don't know for sure. With all that being said, that's going to be all for this video. I know it's definitely a lot heavier of a topic than I think I've ever spoken on before, but let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I have another Juice video dropping tomorrow that will be on the community and just leaks, everything else that's been happening. So with all this being said, we'll see you guys in the next one.